We have a sect that believes that tithe is demonic, tithe is ancestral, tithe is not of God, that tithe is Old Testament. The difference between Old Testament and New Testament is not the middle of the Bible. The difference between Old Testament and New Testament is in the covenant. It's not a book. It's not pages of the book. So whenever somebody says, is it in the New Testament, you may be wrong. Abraham is the father of New Testament. Could be found in all over the Old Testament. But it's the foundation and the bedrock of New Testament. And Abraham instituted tithe out of faith. He did it because he trusted in God. He received the inspiration to pay tithe to God and he followed his spirit. We are all called the sons and daughters of Abraham today. Through faith, he believed in God without knowing where he was going, without knowing his future. He believed against all odds. When there was no reason for him to believe, he still believed. And because of his faith, he was saved and given righteousness and justified by God. All of us sitting here are also justified by faith, tithe is not of the Old Testament. Tithe is of the new covenant in Christ Jesus. The essence why you pay tithe is not that the church needs your money. The essence why you pay tithe is not because God needs your money. The only reason why you pay tithe is because wherever your heart is, wherever your money is, that is where your heart is. Show me a man that loves his wife. You will see on the clothes and the appearance of the wife. You have small money in Assets Bank or maybe Kuda Bank. All of a sudden, you started hearing federal government say, Kuda Bank is... Did, 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 did. We are going to close down. Your heart will be ticking. If you have your money in Bitcoin, you will see the graph go down, red. Bah! You will not be able to sleep. Wherever your heart is, your money is, that is where your heart is. So God is not interested with the money, the physical substance. Whether your tithe is 15, it doesn't concern God. But there is one thing for sure. Your heart can never lie. When you give to God in a way that it is coming from your heart and is from the depth of your heart, that connection, that is what God is after, that relationship. So the, the only thing connecting you and that physical money is in your heart. No man. No man will remove 10% every day or every week to give God and your heart is not there. No man on earth. Imagine over 5 billion Christians in the whole world. Nobody is paying tight anymore. Nobody is funding the gospel. Nobody is doing anything in the church with their money. Who is going to preach? And how shall we preach? How shall this, how shall the gospel move? You may not know that the church is under attack. There is no aspect of the word of God that has not been turned upside down and this is done intentionally in such a way that they are getting more popular. This, this are getting more popular by the day. They are getting more popular. Eventually, in the next two, three years, the most popular concept will win the day.